Muhammad Yusuf Abdullah Harun Urdu, yes F. Arwan 1916 February 2011 was a politician from Sindh, Pakistan. Early life He was the eldest son of Sir Haji Abdullah Harun. He worked closely with Quaid e Azam Muhammad Ali Jinnah as his personal assistant and was active in the Pakistan movement. Yusuf Harun was a witness to All India Muslim League's 25th session in Allahabad in 1930. Career A seasoned politician, Yusuf's involvement in politics spanned nearly seven decades. He served as mayor of pre-independence Karachi May 10, 1944, to May 8, 1945, chief minister of Sindh 1949-50, governor of West Pakistan 1969, and a federal minister. He was also a former high commissioner to Australia. In addition, he worked briefly as chief editor, Daily Dawn newspaper in 1966. After settling down in New York a long time ago, he served as an executive of the now-defunct Pan Am Airlines before retiring. As Chief Minister of Sindh, Yusuf Harun piloted a bill for land reform to abolish large land holdings, although the move was thwarted by fellow politicians. When the bill failed to pass, he resigned from his position as Chief Minister. Among many other things, he will be remembered for releasing Masood Kadarpasha's descending note in the ex Hari Commission report. Foundation of newspaper Yusuf Harun was a founding member of the Don newspaper. In 1946, when Yusuf was in New Delhi to attend a constituent assembly session, Jinnah called him to his residence and asked him to discontinue the newspaper The Herald, then edited by Desmond Young, and instead start the publication of Don newspaper in Karachi, Pakistan, the soon to be independent nation, even though Don's Delhi edition would continue to be published. Jinnah also asked him and his family to buy all the shares of the new newspaper company. He became the chief editor of the Don newspaper in April, 1966 after the long-time editor Altaf Hussain decided to join the cabinet of President of Pakistan, Field Marshal Ayub Khan in March 1965. Altaf Hussain had been hand-picked by Jinnah to be the editor of Don, Delhi before 1947. He was also elected the president of the All Pakistan Newspapers Society of Pakistan for the term 1966-67. Yusuf Harun's independent-looking outlook annoyed the next president of Pakistan General Yahya Khan and he had to leave Pakistan in a hurry to avoid arrest in 1969. He later decided to settle in New York, and remained there after the Yahya Khan government fell in December 1971. Death Yusuf Harun died on February 12, 2011 at the age of 95 in New York. He is survived by only his wife Muluk Pasha Harun and they had no kids. <laughs> <laughs> 